and Callie and Lucky and today the three of us are going to be playing Never Have I Ever! Woo! So guys how this is going to work is I have 50 different Never Have I Ever questions on my cell phone, cell phone, on my iPhone and we are going cell to be phone. going, stop, <laughs> hi how can I help you? We are going to be going through every single question and there's one rule, one rule to this game. And what is it, Callie? You have to be brutally honest. Brutally honest, okay? You can't beat around the bush. It's either I have or I have not. No ifs, ands, or buts. So to be honest, I am a little bit, I'm a little nervous and kind of embarrassed to answer some yeah. of these because we are kind of looking through some of the questions and... Ah! Hey, Lucky, do you want to play Never Have I Ever? Yeah. Are you going to be honest? Are you gonna be fair? Yeah. Okay. You ready to play? Yeah. Okay. You stole my shoulder, be good, bird. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> but wait, before we get started, we have a challenge for you. And you. And you. And especially you in the purple shirt. We wanna see if you guys can like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications in just five, five seconds. seconds. Here goes the countdown. Five, four, three, two, two one. one. Time's up. up. If you guys were successfully able to complete the five second challenge and we want you to comment down below, never have I ever question. And then once you see someone else's never have I ever, comment on theirs yeah. and we'll keep it going. That'll be so much fun. Callie, are you ready to get started? Same. Ah. Never have I ever broken a bone. Three, two, one. You have not? No. The reason I put I have is because I broke my two front teeth and technically your teeth are a bone. What do you guys think? Should that count or should it not count? Have you ever broken a bone? You know what? Also as a double challenge, as you guys watch this video, you can comment your answers to these questions as well. Never have I ever fallen out of bed. One, two, three. I have. I have as well. I feel like everybody at least yeah. once in their life. Yeah, because when you're little, you fall out a lot. Yeah. I mean, I don't really fall out of my bed now because when I was little, I used to like twist and turn in bed mm -hmm. non-stop. This one's, this one's intense. I don't know. Never have I ever been fired. Fired? Like, at a job. Oh. Three, two, one. I have not. I have not. Yeah, well, Callie's too young to even really have a job. Technically babysitting, but yeah. I haven't really been fired. Me neither. Yeah. Other yeah. than uh, having my own business, I've only actually worked somewhere else yeah. one time in my life, which is a daycare. And um, I just don't work there anymore because I got too busy. Never have I ever failed a test. Three, mm -hmm. two, one. I have. I have. I mean, I feel like most people can say that they failed a test at least once, even if it was just like a pop quiz. Yeah. One time I failed a quiz. My teacher had to email my mom for some reason. She had to go, dear Miss Blank. Your daughter has failed this test. Was your mom mad? She was mad. Yeah. Very mad. Never have I ever eaten a bug. Three, two, one. Never. I have. Never. Ever. This says never. I have technically because have you guys ever seen those lollipops with like scorpions, like scorpions, flies, yes. mealworms? I had a scorpion one before. Is that not scorpions poison? Guys, did you know? If you're in Arizona or anywhere that has scorpions, if you shine a black light on a scorpion, it actually glows green. Are you serious? I have a photo, yeah. That's actually so cool. Never have I ever been in love. Three, two, one. Uh, never, frowny face. Well, that's okay. You've still got oh, a long time. Well, I love men without the N. Oh! I'm currently in love with Dan. I love bud. <laughs> I'm also very much in love with this one right here. Do you love me too? <laughs> Lucky, do you hate me? <gasps> Lucky! Lucky, do you love me? Okay. Lucky, do you okay. love me? <laughs> Lucky, do you love Callie? Do you hate me? <laughs> Never have I ever been heartbroken. You can't say eh, it has to be yes or no. Lucky's trying to get to Callie. Hi. Should she get on this? Hi. Three, two, one. I have. Eh, no, yes, I have not. So what's the answer? I have not. Okay, so when I say heartbroken, I don't mean from a, 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 a man per oh. se. I have not, I have not. Wait, no, I have. Okay, so you have. 
Yeah, I, I could see why that may have confused you. So just heartbroken in general. It could be from somebody passing away. It could be from... Oh, yeah, yeah. That's... You know, just anything. My friend not responding to me. I feel you. Never have I ever lost a bet. Three. Two. One. We both have. I always like to be right, but sometimes Same. I'm just not right. Same. You know, I get very mad when I'm not right. Never have I ever bungee jumped. Three, two, one. I have not. I have not. They never will. No. Never. I don't trust them because what if that like just thing just snaps? No, literally, I would <sighs> skydive. I couldn't do it. My soul would leave my body. Never have I ever skydived. Ready? Three, two, mm -hmm. one. I have not. I have not either. I. That's another thing I won't do. I'm not gonna bungee jump. I'm not gonna skydive. I would skydive, just not bungee jump. I wouldn't do either. I'd rather skydive though if I had to, like yeah. to save somebody's life. Can you guys see Lucky anywhere? She's like, yes, like, it looks like you have just like <laughs> dyed red uh, ends to your hair. She's tickling me because she's like nibbling on my hair. Never have I ever ridden a horse. Three, three, two, one. I have many times. I have. Like, I used to do horse camp myself. Okay, so you really have. I've maybe rode a horse three times in my life. Uh, it's not my favorite thing, if I'm being honest with you. Like, what if one of them mentally just goes crazy, and then it just, like, whips me off its back, and I go flying? Yeah. Like, that would be really scary. Yeah, she's tickling my neck. Do you want me to get her? She's good. Sure? Yeah. <laughs> she's laughing. She's nibbling my ear now. She, she imitates laughter. Never have I ever been on TV. I'm thinking of this in a different way. You too. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, because people play on the TVs. Yes, See? so I have. we both put I have because literally sometimes I even watch our own videos on my TV. Okay, mama. So, uh, yeah, yeah, we've been on the TV before, technically. And I've been on the news a couple times, like, whenever they lifted the mask mandate uh, for when you're flying on an airplane, I was on the news, so technically I was on TV. You were? They didn't interview me, but I was like, people sent me pictures. Oh, my gosh, I saw you on the news this morning. Yeah. Because I actually flew the first day that you didn't have to wear a mask anymore. Mm. Never have I ever been slapped. One, two, three. You have? <laughs> By who? Gymnastics. Gee whiz. Well, <laughs> I have not. No one's ever purposefully slapped me. Oh, pur accidentally? Yes, purposefully? Yeah. Never have I ever re-gifted a gift. I have not. I have. I'm not sure though, so I just want I have not. I definitely have a few times if it's like unopened, um, just because I'm like, oh, I don't want this to sit around if someone else could enjoy it, you know? Yeah. The next one is, never have I ever faked being sick. I have not. Oh, I have. Oh yeah. I think I have like, pretendedly and then sort of like, oh, lucky. <laughs> She just like leaps like a leapfrog <laughs> right over to you. Not a care in the world. Oh, lucky. Never have I ever seen the snow. <laughs> we live in PA. We've seen everything. Ready? Three, two, one. Duh. Duh. Yeah, we've seen more snow than we probably want to see, actually. We've been snowed in many times. Yeah. You know, school cancellations, not being able to leave the driveway. One time, remember, we were going somewhere and we started sliding in the car. Yeah, so it was like, and then Kayla, she knows too. She like, kind of like turned her well sideways, so they went forward, so they wouldn't like slide down. Yeah. Never have I ever donated blood. Ready? Three, oh, two, one. one. Did we do it dramatically? <laughs> Absolutely not, you guys. My absolute biggest fear, phobia, whatever, the thing that will make me pass out on the spot is blood. I don't even like to think about it. Um, if I watch somebody else do that, as a matter of fact, it doesn't even have to be me, I would be yeah. white as a ghost and fall to the floor. See, I don't like when people, like, have a needle in me for a long amount of time. If it's, like, a flu shot, it's, like, in, out, fine. But I don't like needles being in me for a long period of time. Like, Ow! Okay, I'm gonna do something with her. A few moments later. Never have I ever broken a heart. So you're the heartbreaker. I have. I have. Enough said. <laughs> Some kid in gymnastics when I used to do it like a few years ago, it's like, she's like cute. He said something along those lines. That's why I like her. He's like, you want me fun? I'm like, no. He like liked me, so I'm like. Never have I ever pulled an all-nighter. 
That's what sleepovers are for. Duh! Three, three two, two, one. one. I have. I have. That's a little bit of sleepovers. Are. Why do they call it a sleepover? No one ever sleeps at a sleepover. I, I used to have some friends that would literally go to bed at like 9.30. A.M.? P.M. Very, very boring. Never have I ever received flowers. Three, two, one. I have. I have. My dad for my Aww. dancing recital gave them to me. That's so sweet. My boyfriend Dan gives me a bouquet of flowers like literally every single week. I love him so much. Never have I ever rock climbed. Can it be, does it have to be like actual like rock climbing on a mountain? Just, or like just any kind of rock climbing. Okay. Three, two, one. I have. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's a rock. I was like, what is she doing? Oh, wait. No, it's not a rock. I was, I was trying to circle how, but I, but no, that was like a rock. So. I thought it was a rock. I'm like, that's creative. Oh, I am a woman. I, I am fearless. I am attraction. I am divine. I'm unbeatable. I'm creative. Honey, you should get in line. Never have I ever sat on a roof. Three, Three two, one. one. I have not. I have because in my old house, I was able to, I don't remember how I got up there. I'm pretty sure my dad helped my brother and I get up there. We would chill on the roof all the time. Never have I ever cut my own hair. Three, Three two, two, one. I have. I have. Right before school picture day when I was in second grade, I looked bad. Do you have a picture of it? I do, actually. What, what if we showed it the video? Eh? I'll insert a picture right here. This is second grade me, the day before picture day. Yes. The next one is, never have I ever touched a cactus. Three, two, one. I have. I have. Do you want to ask a, a fun idea. fact about cactuses? Sure. So you know those really, really tall ones that have like a million arms? Yeah. Those are over hundreds of years old. Really? Because it takes 70 years to see at full height. That, also, that is interesting. In Arizona, it is a felony to target one of those to cut it down. You can like touch the green part, not the spikes, like touch the green part, but you cannot harm it in any way. Otherwise that you will arrest it. Never have I ever gone through a window. I have not. I have not, but to be fair, at my friend's house, I've gone out a window. I mean, it was a um, tiny, tiny window. It was one of the um, playhouse windows. And I was like, this big. Never have I ever lied to someone. Three, two, one. I have. I have. Who hasn't? I have not. I've never told a lie in my life. I, I yeah, have I've lied before. to get off FaceTimes. I have. I'm like, oh, I gotta go. Little, a lot of them for me are little white lies, yes, but I have, you know, had my fair share. Lies. Never have I ever gone vegan. Three, two, one. one. I have not. I did for about almost one month, and then I went to Arby's, and that was it. It was all over. Never have I ever had an allergic reaction. Three, two, one. I have. What are you allergic to? Pollen. Pollen, okay. Fleas. Fleas. I got flea bites, and <laughs> we had to go to the doctor. I had to take this disgusting medicine, <laughs> and I had to put little cream on every bug bite. That's why there's scars up and down my arms. It's from really? those bug bites. Oh, my gosh. How long ago was that? Years ago. It would be insanely oh. itchy. And my husband would be like, stop doing that. You can't scratch us. Let it heal. Let it be again. It'd be hard not to. No, I can't. I'm allergic to honeycomb. I'm also allergic to a certain medicine called penicillin. And most of all, I am highly allergic to hamsters. I almost had to be rushed to the emergency room because uh, my cousin had a hamster and it had like nine babies. And I was sleeping in that room with nine hamsters and I couldn't breathe. So. Yeah, that was fun. Never have I ever farted in class. Should we just say yes or no? Goes faster. I was going to say that. Yeah, guys. So we're just going to put yes or no instead of I have or I have not. Okay, ready? Three, two, two one. <laughs> the face. Mm -hmm. um, actually, it wasn't in class. It was in the nurse's office. I was taking my friend to the nurse or something. And it was so obvious that I just wanted to disintegrate into the floor. Never have I ever cheated on a test. Three, Three two, two, one. No. I have. Not where I wrote the answers out on my arm or something, but like if I was sitting next to a really smart classmate, I would kind of, you know, oh, did they do A or B for that one? So not gonna lie, like, yeah, I have. <laughs> Never have I ever eaten paper. Three, two, two one. one. No. I have, for some reason, I remember like at the deli when we go grocery shopping, they give you like a little paper ticket 
for your number in line and I would always like eat them. I don't know why. So weird, but I specifically remember that. And then I'd eat a piece of cheese. They'd give me, they'd be like, you want a free piece of cheese, hon? I'd be like, yeah. And then I'd stop eating my paper. Never have I ever skipped class. Wait, does it skipping class count going to the council office and missing three periods? It's like if you purposefully oh, oh, yeah. miss no. it. Ready? Three, three two, three, one. one. No. I have one time I didn't study for this uh, test and we were playing a game related to the test questions and I didn't want to feel stupid. So my mom actually picked me up from school and she took me to get squishy pencil toppers. I used to collect them. This was in fifth grade. She met you? Yeah, she took me home for the two hours that that was going to be going on. And then we got squishies and Why? got like ice cream. Cause she's nice. Your mom's the best. <laughs> Mom made this. <laughs> well, you should have studied. Give me your iPad. Give me your phone. You cannot hang out. You have to sit in this house and you have to study. You have to study this. You gotta study this. Yeah, you cannot have your phone. My mom again. I'm not picking you up. No, I don't care. So yeah, technically that's skipping class. So never have I ever ding dong ditched. Three, two, one. <laughs> yeah, duh. I definitely have. I think it's probably just like my grandma or something, but it still counts. Remember when, when you and your baby said we would still grab candy from your grandma's house? Oh yeah, we would walk to my grandma's house and just take like random tea, tea candy, bags and candy. candy. Yeah, and I remember watch, that. And then go watch movies. Never have I ever stolen something. Three, two, one. Okay, can I explain myself? Yeah, I'll explain myself too. So, I was at my friend's house and we were... We're not gonna sleep in home and we're gonna sleep in their room, but we're gonna do makeup. So someone put Okay, wait, wait. Is this a story about you accidentally? Yeah. If it's an accident, it doesn't count. You have oh. to do it like purposely. That was an no. accident. Wait, wait. No. Guys, I have okay. not stolen because one time I accidentally did where a thing where my friends was placing two of my bag to take to a different room and then we forgot about it. Okay. That's the but only that, that doesn't count. So yeah. when I was like ten um, do you guys know Crocs, the shoes Crocs? Yeah. I used to love collecting the little buttons because they were really fun. And I stole a couple from Target off the shoes. And I stole a bag of squishies from somebody's locker in sixth grade. I'm just being Did honest. Did you ever find out? Uh, no. Can you tell us? This is the weirdest question ever. Never have I ever eaten my toenail. Ready? Three, two, mm -hmm. one. No. No. Who the heck eats their toenails? Guys, if you eat your toenails, what are you doing? Like, I, I really would just be like flabbergasted if one of you answered yes to that. Who does that? Oh, never have I ever swore at a teacher. No. No. Nope, never know. You guys are swearing at your teachers, man. It's high schools. Well, I would hope not. That's so disrespectful. What? Okay. Never have I ever kissed a wall. I'm seeing your hand so fast. No! Three, two, one. Yeah. You have two? I kissed a shower wall. Kissed a shower wall. Why? Because you just loved it? You were happy? <laughs> I don't even know. I was like, I was like, Mwah. Okay. I kissed my stuffed animal bear one time. Well, that's okay. But we're talking about walls. So, Probably. actually, I kissed a wall several times once because... Okay, I'm just gonna say it. Prior to this, I had been hanging out with somebody who was pretty toxic. I did not enjoy their energy. So when I finally got back home, I was so relieved to be away from them that quite literally, I kissed the walls of my house and said, I love you, I love you, I love this house because I was so happy to be back home. Me though. Never have I ever stolen money. Three, two, one. Nope. No, I've never stolen money. I, uh... I couldn't steal anything from anyone, especially money. I mean, like, okay, I'm not counting when I was 10, 11 years old, but like, I have such a guilty conscience. I always think any tiny thing I do, I'm like, oh, what if I get karma for this? Oh my God, I'm so sorry, God. I can't do anything like Me that. Though. No, literally, I live in fear if I do anything slightly bad. Never have I ever dated your best friend. Never have I ever dated my best friend. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Nope. Now, never have I ever laughed so hard you peed. Three, two, one. I love your illustration of, yeah, you have. Must have been pretty dang hilarious. I don't think I have. Like, I can't recall of a certain time. I mean, it's possible, but I don't think so. Never have I ever lied to my parents. Why did I say parents? Three, two, one. 
<laughs> the curse I like how it's like a, have you lied to your parents? You're just like, yes, I have. Like, like dainty? Yes. I have too. Wait. Who hasn't? I mean, like, if you haven't, good for you. I'm not encouraging you to lie to your parents at all, but. Yes. Have you ever lied to your parents? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. And then they found out. Never have I ever ate cold pizza. Three, two, one. Yes. Yes. I don't like it, but I've, I've eaten it before. Some people like it. Cool. Do you like cold pizza, guys? Cold pizza is better than my school pizza. Never have I ever eaten a raw egg. Ugh. That's how you get salmonella. Three, two, one. No. That's how you get salmonella. Well, I mean, I've eaten like raw cookie dough. We got same, but they mean like to get like an little... actual egg. Okay, this next one. <laughs> Never have I ever peed in the pool. Three, two, one. Yes, who has not? Honestly, sometimes I still do. <laughs> Nothing to say here. Never have I ever gotten lost. Three, two, one. I have. So my dad was like, if you can find these things that your mother wants, I'll buy you a treat. A treat? And I'm like, okay, dad. And I'm like, and I couldn't find them. And my dad finds them, but he couldn't find me. And then some woman's like, honey, are you lost? And I'm like, I remember the story. And I'm like, yeah. And she's like, what did your dad look like? And I didn't want to say, I didn't want to say, you want to say he was bald? Yeah. And I'm like, um, he, he's, he's a man. He's tall. He's pale. He's pale. I don't know if I said pale. That's so funny. So how did you end up finding him? He was like, what are you doing? I'm like, ah. Okay, so when I got lost, I was actually in my grandma's woods. You know, she has like that wooded area behind yeah. her house. Yeah, so I was trying to find this little, um, quote unquote, clubhouse, no, tree house. It was abandoned, but there was like a little slide and like a ladder. Wait, you've seen it before? Yeah. So I got lost and um, I heard from Barney that if you got lost, you're supposed to hug a tree and blow a whistle. I didn't have a whistle, but I hugged a tree and I yelled, help, help. And then my mom found me. I was six. So yes, I have been lost before. Never have I ever met a famous person. Three, two, one. I have. I have um, you. Ah. <laughs> I met Bethany Moda. Um, Who is that? Oh my gosh, you don't know her. That's that makes me feel so old. She was my inspiration to start doing YouTube again. So uh, she was like a really, really popular beauty influencer. So she used to go by Mac Barbie 07. But yeah, I, I uh, went to her meet and greet at Ross Park Mall. And it's crazy to think that we had a meet and, and greet there. What'd she say? There? Were you like, I quit YouTube? Uh, no, it was like one of those things. There was a huge line of people outside the doors, like, like outside and it was snowing. Um, yeah, we waited for four hours. It was insane. It was very quick interaction. But anyway, the next one is never have I ever dyed my hair. I have. Yeah. Callie has dyed hers. Kind of like the same color that I have dyed mine. I dyed mine purple for the meet and greet. I've dyed it with food dye. I've attempted to dye it with Kool-Aid. It's been my scalp bitch, but. She's adventurous with her hair. I have gotten highlights. Never have I ever gotten sunburnt. Three, two, one. I have. I, have. I feel like who hasn't? Never have I ever gagged at a dinner. Three, two, one. Russell Sprouts. Okay, so I've actually come to like them, by the way. And um, if they're prepared a certain way, but so Dan and I actually went to a really fancy restaurant about three weeks ago and we were so excited. But when they brought the steak out to us, you guys, I kid you not, it smelled like a butt. It smelled so bad. It was obviously Ooh. like rotten meat. I actually gagged. I, I can't remember tasting anything more worse. So I did gag about that. And the very last question, Never have I ever had a secret hidden candy stash. Ready? Three, two, one. I have. And as a matter of fact. Yes, I still do. I do. I will. You know what? This might be too big. Okay. Yeah. Oh, don't mind the teddy bear. It looks so good. This is quite the stash. Count now, Cal, you want to. <laughs> I'm kidding. What? Oh, oh. I fell out of the chair. A few moments later. Okay, ready? So you guys, that was all for this Never Have I Ever little game. Yeah. It was so much fun. If you guys like this video, then please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up.
And if you guys really, really liked this video, yes. we'll do a part two but with go ahead. your questions. Your never have I ever questions. We'll put together yes. a big list of all things that you guys want to know. So anyways, thank you all again for watching. We love you to the minute back and we will talk to you all very soon. Bye. Bye. Mwah.